Welcome back everybody to a special edition of Block Play Toys. Today we're going to be going over some upcoming news. Lego has announced with Nintendo that they are releasing a new wave of Lego Super Mario coming in 2025. And yes, it is around Mario Kart. We have been looking forward to this for a long time, so let's go ahead and dive into the news. <laughs> So here we are guys, it's no longer just a theory, it is very real. You can see it on the official LEGO site, LEGO Super Mario Mario Kart coming into battle on 2025. It is also on the official Nintendo website where you can start to see a little bit of an overview of the different sets. So that's what we're going to be doing today is breaking down everything that's been announced so far for this particular release. So let's go ahead and get into the details. And we want to give a huge shout out to falconbricks.com who actually has this wonderful overview. If you guys want to go to falconbricks.com to check out the full article, we recommend you do so. Uh, but you can kind of see a nice summary here at the top of this link with the different types of characters that are going to be involved, the different carts that are going to be involved. Lots of cool stuff you can see. I see Donkey Kong. I see a new Yoshi with a lighter blue. Very cool. Like Kitu, Toad, Peach, Mario. I see some bananas, all sorts of stuff. So let's go ahead and get into the specific releases. So the very first one we're going to get into here is the Yoshi bike. It is going to be set 72031 and it looks awesome. The build comes with some sort of really cool mystery block, something that we actually haven't seen before. Uh, it looks like kind of like a rainbow color mystery block, maybe for the rainbow road. But I got to say the funniest thing I've, I've seen off the bat here is the banana character that's down here. There is an extra shell. And if you guys look here, I see the blue, I've seen the uh, red shell in the back. I think you can swap that out with the green shell. There's all these cool cones. But the big part here is look at the bike build. It looks actually pretty, pretty sweet. There's a lot of aspects of the Yoshi components, whether it's green, even the kind of clear plate you see uh, with the two eyes. It looks like it's a Yoshi on a Yoshi. And of course, we're getting a new Yoshi character. We've had multiple different types of Yoshis come up in the different waves of the LEGO Super Mario releases. But this is the first light blue one. Uh, there actually is already a dark blue one, a pink one, a yellow one, a red one, a green one. So this is going to be yet another addition to the set. I do like the different odes to the Yoshi egg that you can kind of see up by each of the wheels and also on the side here. And if you look close enough, you can see that there is a reader on the seat of the bike. However, it is interesting to me that they actually are putting a Yoshi on there because I don't believe they're going to release a digital scanner Yoshi. So it is unique that they're going to have a non-scannable character on top of the bike. Obviously, this must mean that for Luigi, uh, Peach, Luigi, and Mario, there's an opportunity for them to ride the bike as well. But we're not done, so let's keep going. The next and most prominent of the pictures we've seen thus far is the standard cart that is going to be set 72032. It looks awesome. You have your race car, probably the most sporty of all the cars right now. It has the fire coming out of the back. You get another uh, banana figure here, another shell, much like the game, you'd be used to it. Um, there's also like a toad mechanic here who has a very specific headpiece. He has his to uh, toad sticker on the side of it, and he's got a different type of helmet, almost like he's part of a pit crew with some scan and diagnostics here. There are two readers on this, which is interesting. So I imagine the first reader that you were pointing to here at the top, that one is probably for the Toad and how the Lego Mario, Peach, or Luigi would interact there. But if you look closer at the actual cart, this is probably a little bit of a preview into what we're going to be getting. You can see that the actual word start is on the reader. So I imagine for future levels with this next wave, when you actually put your character onto one of these particular Lego Mario carts, it's going to start a new experience in how you complete a course for the Lego Super Mario sets. To this point, these have only been found in starter pipes and the cannon pipe that we had with the uh, Bowser airship. So this is the first time we're getting a starter reader without actually getting a starter pipe. Um, again, this looks really good. The price point is good at $19.99. It comes with 174 figure, uh, pieces, and we'll see when we get a little bit closer what exactly we'll get with this experience. But we're not done. Next up, we have Donkey Kong and DK Jumbo. This is set 72033. It's coming out on January 1st with the rest. It's a little more expensive than the other two sets we just talked through. It is at $34.99 USD. It comes with 387 parts. And we get a Donkey Kong, which for the first time in a while, we haven't been able to get a Donkey Kong since the Donkey Kong specific wave. Again, I find it interesting, unless there's something I don't see here, uh, that we're going to have some non-reader scanner uh, characters that are going to be in the carts themselves when it looks like the design play is probably more for Mario, Peach, and Luigi, but we'll see how it goes. 
Cool thing here is you're getting more of these shells. It looks like it's going to be a pretty standard part of all of these sets. And who doesn't want another Donkey Kong character? It looks really cool. It looks like he has some sort of uh, weapon here. It looks like that'll probably shoot the shells. You can kind of see it in front of him on the steering wheel. And the cart re resembles a barrel, which if you guys have played the game, you know Donkey Kong and barrels go hand in hand. And of course, what is a LEGO Super Mario Kart set without that sweet little banana hanging out on that target? So we look forward to this Donkey Kong set, but yet again, there's more! So if you guys have seen the LEGO Super Mario Brothers movie, you will have noticed there is an ode to Baby Mario and Baby Luigi, and guess what? We're getting a set that actually has both of them together with individual cars, so two cars for one. It is set 72034. The name of the set is Baby Mario vs. Baby Luigi. It is priced at $29.99 USD and comes with 321 pieces. And look, you get to build, for the first time, a LEGO Baby Mario and a LEGO Baby Luigi. That's probably worth the set unto itself. You're gonna have a lot of other components here. Again, flames, probably tinier cars, um, but the design details here are really sweet. The ability to shoot the shells looks like it's standard in all of these carts you'll have some targets you have flames on both cars only three wheels it looks like on the luigi set so that's pretty clever and you have the standard m for baby mario the l for baby luigi i gotta say i kind of like the engine with the mystery block component to the engine on baby luigi but that's just me i'm a big fan of both of the characters i'm looking forward to getting this build but wait there's still more yes there's still more Toad's Garage, set 72035, looks pretty awesome. Not just because we love Toad, which by the way, you're getting another two Toads, it looks like, with the same type of mechanic outfits on, the helmets and the stickers. These are blue, whereas the previous one on the standard cart was red. But look at this, you don't just get a cart this time, which also comes with a shooter, which also comes with exhaust, four wheels, and it looks like a scanner cart in there too. Um, there's multiple scanner cards actually you can see here. It comes on a mechanic stand like you're building an actual garage. From what we can tell so far, it looks like there's at least a scanner here on the side next to this first toad, one in the cart, and I believe there's one or two back here. It's hard to tell if there's a fifth one on top of this tower here, but either way, you're gonna get an awesome place to service your LEGO Super Mario Kart uh, vehicles. You also have extra tires in the back. You can rotate them out. I'm kind of wondering if you're going to have the option to put the black tires and the blue tires on. We'll see what happens when you actually get close to it. But it looks super sweet. This one's going to be priced at $39.99, come with 390 pieces, and we are looking forward to building it. But the grand picture that we've seen thus far, this is the one that's probably floating the most around the internet at the moment, is the Baby Peach and Grand Prix set. So as we mentioned, we got a Baby Mario and Baby Luigi. We're also getting a Baby Peach. Oh, how cute. And it looks like they're coming with all sorts of different characters for this particular one. We're going to get a Toad on a bike, Baby Peach on her vehicle, and is that a Larry Koopa? Yeah, Lemmy. That's a Lemmy Koopa. We're getting a Lemmy Koopa on his little airship type of cart. All of which, again, we'll see a common theme of shooters for shells, bananas, mystery blocks. But the nice thing about this particular set is you actually kind of have a starting slash finish line that comes here. Lakitu is up there with the one, two, three lights. If you guys have played the game, you know that the lights are switching on and off with every lap. Looks like we have a refreshment stand over here on the side, some arrows to point away. And in the background, you can kind of see a first, second, and third place victor stand. I'm trying to zoom in. It looks like there might be a scanner on the number one set. Um, and I'm imagining there's probably some scanners here. I can see a little bit on the Baby Peach when there is one. I'm assuming there's also one on the Toad vehicle as well as the Lemmy Koopa vehicle. This is 72036. This is the highest priced item out of the whole new wave that we can see thus far. It is priced at $79.99 and it comes with a whopping 823 pieces. Now I have to say, all of these sets are very exciting. We're really, really curious how this is going to come together from a gameplay perspective. The thing I'm most surprised about is the fact that we're going to have readers on carts, but not necessarily characters that can read those scanners. So we're going to see how that all plays together. I kind of wonder if you guys have watched some of our previous vehicles. We had a Lego Bowser muscle car set that we just reviewed, and it also has a scanner inside of it. So we're kind of clever, or curious I should say, is if we're actually going to see something along those lines and see if it actually can move. You get some action while the character, characters are moving. But in any case, we're super pumped. We're very excited to see it. We love LEGO Super Mario. We've been waiting for a long time. I think there's going to be a ton of opportunity with this particular build to actually get to a place of building maybe tracks, 
Um, hopefully, hopefully in the future we're going to get some additional scanners beyond Mario, Peach, and Luigi. Maybe Wario, something like that. That would be even really, really cool. But one thing we'd like to see in the future is maybe a full set where you have an enclosed course. So you can go end to end, build a really, really awesome uh, racing course with multiple lanes for multiple cars. For the time being, we're super pumped. It's coming out in 2025. It is going to be the 40th anniversary of Super Mario Brothers. All sorts of cool stuff happening. New movie happening. New Lego waves happening. We'll have it all for you guys. So don't forget to like and subscribe and stay tuned for more Lego news, Lego Super Mario news. And we'll see you next time on Block Play Toys. Mm -hmm.